how to get x-ray in Minecraft 1.20.3. Let's go ahead and jump on into it. Now, first things first, we need to go to this link. This is the second link in the description down below, and this is how to get x-ray in Minecraft Java Edition. It's our text guide on getting x-ray. Now, one thing I will mention, this is for Java Edition, but we do have a guide also linked down below specifically for Bedrock Edition, and this is how to get it on Bedrock as well. This guide that you're watching now is going to cover Java, so if you do want Bedrock, go check out that one in the description. But nevertheless, once you're here on the Java Edition guide, you want to scroll down and click on the download x-ray ultimate button to go to minecraft or excuse me x-ray ultimates official download page once you're on x-ray ultimates official download page what you want to do is go to the files tab here and then you want to find the 1.20.2 version the 1.20.2 version will work in 1.20.3 so we're going to go in here and click on the three dots and click download file then after a few seconds, the download will begin. You may need to keep or save this file depending on your browser, but while this is downloading, come from our company, Simple Game Hosting. You shouldn't use X-Ray on a Minecraft server, and luckily, if you start your own server at the first link in the description down below, the breakdown.xyz slash sgh, you can X-Ray all you want. Because you own the server, you make the rules, you can do anything that you want on that server, including add mods, plugins, mod packs using our one-click, super simple mod pack installer. And should you have any issues with your server along the way, there's expert live chat support to help you out. So that means no matter what, there's someone there to help you out while you're setting up and running your Minecraft server. So if you want to start a Minecraft server, use Xtrail you want and not have to worry about getting banned from it. Go check out Simple Game Hosting at the first link in the description down below the breakdown to XYZ slash SGH to start your Minecraft server the simple way and start playing Minecraft with your friends. Nevertheless, the download is now complete. I do want to mention that Optifine is recommended for this, but Optifine's a bit outdated these days. So I'm going to show you how to use X-Ray in game without Optifine, but there is a guide in the description to get Optifine that will always be up to date to the most recent version that Optifine's released for. Currently, though, that's two versions out of date, but hopefully it gets up to date pretty soon. Nevertheless, let's go ahead and minimize our browser, and I'm going to go ahead and open up Minecraft. So here we are on the Minecraft main menu. Now, it is worth noting you want to find the x-ray file you downloaded. Now, for me, that's going to be in my downloads folder here. As you can see, x-ray ultimate. I'm going to drag that to my desktop, but you do want to know where that file's at because we're going to need to move it into Minecraft here. So if we go ahead and go into options and then resource packs, we're going to be able to open the pack folder. Folder. So that was pretty fast. Let's do it one more time. From the main menu, click on Options, Resource Packs, and then click Open Pack Folder here. That opens the Resource Packs folder, and we can drag and drop X-Ray Ultimate into the Resource Packs folder, right like so. Close out of that, and now here it is, X-Ray Ultimate on the left-hand side. Hover over this, click the play kind of icon, the arrow that appears, and move it over into selected. When we click done, X-Ray is activated, and we can go actually test it on a simple game hosting server. Like I said, a simple game hosting server can have X-Ray because you own the server. Just like I own this server right here. This is my own personal server. I own it. I can X-Ray on it without fear of consequences because, well... If anyone's going to ban me, it's going to be me banning me, which doesn't make any sense. Why would I do that? So here we are in game. We can immediately see that X-Ray is in fact working here. Um, something else that is worth noting, it's hard to see though, right? Let me go ahead and go down underground here just so I can show you what I mean. So underground here, we can see that uh, there are ores, but I mean, we can't really see them. I mean, it's very difficult. How do we fix this without Optifine? Well, we drink a night vision potion. As soon as we do that... Boom, we can see all of the ores that are around us, including, uh, I think there's some diamonds. Yeah, right there, looking good. Now, what if you don't want to have to get a night vision potion in game? You can use commands for this. So we can go ahead and do the slash effect command, and we can do effect clear, for example, to clear our night vision, or we can do effect, and then we want to give. And we're going to give ourselves, our username, the night vision effect. So we're going to do Minecraft, and then the effect is going to be night vision vision but you can do infinite meaning you're always going to have night vision until you run that effect clear username command there so now that we have night vision forever we can easily see this stuff and by the way this does work in the nether meaning that you can go for ancient debris as you can see right there there is some ancient debris for us to be able to uh, go mine if we want, making getting netherite a lot easier than, uh, you know, just randomly blowing up beds, for example. And then if we come back in here, we can see that we do have diamonds and all that stuff. And if we ever want to turn X-Ray off, stop using it, we can do that. Just go into Options, Resource Packs, and move it from the Selected section here over to the Available section. Just click that arrow to move it to Available. When we click Done and go back in game, X-Ray is now off. We can turn off the night vision effect with that effect clear command and boom, we're good. 
Now if we want to turn it back on, we can go into Options, Resource Packs, click it from Available, back to Selected, click Done, and now night or X-Ray is back on. Give ourselves the night vision effect again, and boom, we're back to X-Ray. So that quick and that easy to get X-Ray enabled in Minecraft Java Edition. If you've got any questions, let us know in the comment section down below, and we will see you in the next video. My name is Nick, and I am out. Peace.